do you reckon you can handle this? Hello guys and welcome back to yet another one with us, The Review Bros. My name is Aaron and today I am bringing you a hardcore pre-workout in the form of Reckoning by HC Platinum. And I want to say a big thank you to them for sending it down to us. You know we're going to get into all the usuals, the taste and mixability, the price, the label, the effects and wrap it off with a final verdict. So strap in guys, stay tuned, here it comes. Let's get into the taste and the mixability of this product, guys. Now, it comes in four flavours, which is a massive thumbs up. It means you get, you know, a bit of choice out there. So it comes in berry juiced. It comes in mango madness. It comes in joker juice, which is the one I have. And it also comes in blue slushy, which is the one that Craig has. Now, apparently that one is like a blue coconut. Uh, Craig has sent me his thoughts and feelings on it, so I will reveal that. But let's get through this one. Joker juice. So it's one scoop, and that scoop does weigh a 15.5 grams. So, you know, a respectable scoop. In she goes. Let's do this. It smells strong in the air. Nice, though. A little bit of leakage there. All right, here we go. It's got like a grape berry sort of flavour to it. Let's go for it. Mmm. Yeah, that's good. That is actually really, really nice. Um, no funny aftertaste, no like, you know, med medicinal taste. It tastes to me like a grape, a grape bombsicle, if that's such a thing. So I'm gonna give it a nine out of 10. I really think that's very well done. Let's show you this mixability while we're at it. So as you can see, it actually mixes really well too. So yeah, a solid nine out of 10 there at least. Craig gave his one a nine out of 10 too. Money time, guys. Money talks. Let's get into the breakdown of this price product. So, you can pick this up from Complete Health Supplements for $54.99. Now, it comes in a very strange 22 servings per the container. So, you will get through this tub a bit quicker than those 25 or 30 serving containers, quite obviously. Now, I can tell you that that broken down would be $2.49 per the serving. So, it is definitely more expensive than an average product. But there are two things I'd like to mention. One, if you check out some other websites, some uh, some of the offshoots of the Complete Health, I can see that they do have some discounts going on right now, up to five to $10 off of this product. So it's definitely worth shopping around and having a look. Now what I'll say is that is a three out of 10 on our very consistent price scale. Now, the weakness with that scale is you are getting a lot for your money. So you know what, I'm, I'm willing to pay a bit more if the effects of the product are very good. So bear that in mind, that is a three out of 10 on a consistent scale, but this might be better than a, you know, an average product. So three out of 10. Now UK guys, a bit more difficult to get hold of, but it is doable. Obviously I'm from the UK, I've got hold of it. You can pick this up for roughly, on the um, comparison, 44 pounds and 53 pence for the tub. Obviously, again, 22 servings. That'll be two pounds and two pence per the serving. So yeah, definitely more expensive than normal. Three out of 10 is that consistent price score. It is label time, guys. Let's get through it. So 22 servings, 15.5 grams per the serving. So we start off with sodium and vitamin B12, just for energy production and, and muscular contractions. So we then move into the strength and pump matrix, which starts off with citrulline malate at seven grams, which is a very good amount, guys. You're going to be getting a, 
over four grams worth of pure L-citrulline, so it's gonna boost nitric oxide levels up in the bloodstream and give you some nasty cums. That's a good start to this label. Then we have beta alanine at above the clinical dose at 3.5 grams. So you should expect those itchy, tingly feelings. Um, and when it builds up in the system, it gives you endurance in the gym. It's a good ingredient to have. Then we have taurine at a gram that just helps with hydration and can help with pumps alongside that. So a good ingredient and a good dose. Agmatine sulfate follows at 750, a tad lower than we normally see, but again, it'll help boost nitric oxide levels and it'll work with that citrulline to give you some pumps, good stuff. Then we have the patented S7, which is a blend of seven ingredients on the screen right now. They're gonna give you some pumps, so it's been shown to boost nitric oxide levels up by up to 230%. So that's a good ingredient to have. So nephrine finishes this matrix off at 30 milligrams. Now that's normally in there for weight loss, fat burning and, and giving you some energy. So I'm not too sure why it's been chucked in that matrix, but it's a good ingredient to have. The energy and focus matrix comes next with starting L-theanine at 350 milligrams. Now, a lot of people ain't gonna like that ingredient in there at that dosage. That is a blanket to stimulants. It prolongs stimulant effects and gives sort of an anti-crash and anti-jitters mechanism. Now, some people think it tapers uh, stimulants down too much, especially when it's above the caffeine level. We're gonna build, build on that in the effects section and let you guys know if it really does taper it down too much or not. Then we have caffeine anhydrous at 250 milligrams, which is a tad on the low side, but you'll understand why in a second. That is a main stimulant in this product. It's gonna give you the energy needed to get stuff done in the gym. Aria durensis follows at a 200 milligram dosage. Now that is high, guys. That's a central nervous stimulant. It's gonna give you a huge hit of energy and focus. We love that ingredient. That's why caffeine's a bit lower because it's another stimulant in there. Then we have another standout ingredient in the form of two amino, which is DMHA, guys. Powerful stuff. Central nervous stimulant again, and a huge boost of energy at 175 milligrams. It's gonna work well with the area uh, Then we have uh, well, then we have Infinity, sorry, which is decaffeine malate. So that's a slower version of caffeine anhydrous. It digests a bit slower, so it gives you an anti-crash mechanism. That's why that caffeine anhydrous is a bit lower. Then we have N-methyltyramine, again, another stimulant, guys. So it's gonna boost energy levels, and it does help with weight loss as well. Astrogen finishes off this whole label and that just helps with digestion and getting everything into you as efficiently as possible. So that is a good label, guys. Let's see how it comes together in those effects. Effects time, guys, of Reckoning by HC Platinum. Now, how did we get on with this product, myself and Craig? Well, we thoroughly enjoyed using this product for a couple of reasons. Well, more than a couple. The most important one, I think it was a very, very good all-rounded product. It delivered in those three elements we are looking for. Pumps, focus and energy. Now, energy was very, very good. You know, you definitely felt it, despite that 350 milligrams of L-theanine that some people don't like, and I can completely understand that. For us, it generally hits as hard, it just prolongs that energy. So this is a pre-workout that I could recommend you take in the morning and you'll probably feel it for a lot of the rest of the day. There's no crash with the product with the l dose. It just keeps you in a nice, happy, mood elevated high. You know what, and that's what we got from it. It was a very happy pre-workout to train on. You wanted to kill your sessions each and every time. Pumps alongside that energy were very, very good. You know what? They were nasty pumps each and every time we used them. You know, you start off with a whopping seven grams of citrulline malate. Um, you've got a good amount of taurine in there. You've got the agmatine and you've got the S7. So you're definitely getting, you know, a, a large range of ingredients for pumps. Pumps for me, nine out of 10 at least. Focus, again, I actually felt zoned in. I felt happy. It felt mood elevating. Craig has said the exact same thing. We felt dialed in. We felt focused. We felt happy to, you know, to kill the training sessions on the four or five times that we've used this product. It would be one of those products I'd use on my days off. Now, in terms of who is it made for, it's not for a beginner because it does still have DMHA and Aria Durensis in them. Now, they are powerful stimulants, guys, as you are fully well aware. So what I would say is it is a stim junkie beginner's pre-workout. Now, what I mean by that is the strongest daily driver is probably a bit stronger than that. It's probably something I'd only recommend using three times a week because it is a strong product. It, it actually keeps that hardcore name. So it's a stim junkie beginner's product. It's not an, a blow your head off product at the same time. So I wouldn't say it's for an advanced stim junkie. It doesn't come with, you know, absolutely crack head feels. It's a productive stim head junkie pre-workout. Nice and strong feels productive, feels mood elevating, 
prolonged lasting non-jittery um, energy. No other negatives come alongside it. There's no cold sweats, jitters, no stomach problems, no, you know, no negatives at all. And another point, beta alanine for this product was strong. You definitely get those itches, those tingles. You know, you want to scratch your eyes out before training. Myself and Craig, you know, we love that feeling. It really does get us in the zone. And we're going to consider absolutely everything on this product and give it a nine out of 10. It really was a very good product. It actually surprised us. Um, really, really well done actually to the, the guys over there. So a well done to them. Nine out of 10. It's in line with things like Superhuman Supreme, MV Pre, you know, it's up there with them. A nine out of 10 is where it is going to land. So it is good stuff, guys. Okay, guys, final verdict on Reckoning by HCS Platinum. Now, the, you know what, I think they killed it, but I'm gonna roll through the scores on the doors as I normally do and give you a final synopsis on the product. So, the taste and the mixability. Myself and Craig, we had different flavors. I had Joker juice, he had the slushy flavor. You know what, nine out of 10 for both of them. They were really well done, mixed fine, absolutely no complaints, really, really nice. Price? Unfortunately, fell a bit short at a three out of 10 on that consistent scale. Now, what I will say is do shop around. I know for a fact you can find it cheaper than the price I mentioned, and that's what I would recommend. Do try and find it cheaper, guys. Um, and effects, most important part of this and any other review, nine out of 10. It was a solid all-rounding product. You know what, it was a very, very, very strong daily driver or a beginner's uh, stim junkie product delivered in focus pumps energy. It, you know what, it was a nice mood elevating pre as well. It, it delivered well. So you know what, it got that nine out of 10 and that gives us a total score of 21 out of 30. So it is really well done, really enjoyed using this product. It's probably something I'll use off of review day so that goes to show how much I did enjoy it. What I do, the, the synopsis I'd say is it's up there with the stronger, really good products that are very well dosed in a lot of areas. I will say just shop around and try to find it cheaper. That is my synopsis. Um, a very good product though, so um, well worth picking up uh, should you be thinking about it. Thank you guys for watching along. You know what, we've got this and so many more reviews coming out. So please do hit that subscribe button if you haven't by this point. Hit the thumbs up. You know what, we're trying to grow the channel as best we can and we need your help and we really appreciate it when we get it, guys. You wouldn't believe it. So um, yeah, as always, stay stimmed. And this will do the job.